Hello, hello, hello! It's Mickey Manching, and welcome to this. Is this St. Patrick's Day today, or is it tomorrow? I don't know, but I'm not wearing green, so I hope that I'm not going to get pinched. Anyway, tonight we have two great shows for you, the first of which is Class Act, and I'm going to go away and come right back because I'm in Class Act, but here we go. Come on up, Class Act! Hello, everybody! <laughs> We are class, there we go. Now we got the whole gang up here. We are class act. We are the Vintage Improv Festival House five star long form improv team. We are super excited. We perform every second Sunday of the month here at the Follies. So uh, that's us. And to get us going, um, tomorrow is 314, which is Pi Day. So um, Pi makes me think of math, makes me think of uh, school. So if you could uh, come out with one of your favorite memories of back when you were in school, a, a happy memory of school, and we're going to use that to inspire a whole show. So yell it out, type it in the chat. Oh, how sad. This one says, I have no happy memories of school. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> All right, I see cinnamon rolls, cinnamon rolls. Thank you very much, cinnamon rolls. We well, lost Shirley. They, 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 they made me take, uh, they made me take home ec in high school, home ec. I, I, I moved to Florida and they didn't want me to take chemistry, but they made me take home ec. And, and, and I didn't realize, but um, there was like a click. And if you belonged to the little click, the home ec teacher gave you cinnamon. <laughs> and if you didn't belong to the home ec click, you had to bring your own. So <laughs> so oh. we were like always missing ingredients because we, my, my friend whose name was Vicky Click and I weren't in the click. And, uh, <laughs> and so we didn't ever have the right ingredients. Uh, I... I was, um, I, I used to travel by myself when I was in high school. I would meet my family in Florida and I had a problem with time and time zones. And I'm in Chicago and I didn't realize that St. Louis was an hour ahead of us. So we'd fly in the St. Louis and I really, I loved honey buns. So I had to go get a honey bun. So I went to get a honey bun and I get back for my flight and they go, Mr. Edgy, the flight left, you know, like a half hour. <laughs> and I said, but I, and so they got me on another flight. And when I got to Florida, everybody was calling through the, on the loudspeakers, Mr. Edgy, Mr. Edgy, looking for Mr. Edgy. And it was just quite a moment. Oh. Well, well, Cinnamon is a, is a natural aphrodisiac, especially for guys. So, you know, ladies, if you want to get your guy all revved up, or guys, if you want to get your guy all revved up, give him lots of cinnamon. I didn't know this for a long time, and I was wondering why my wife was providing cinnamon rolls and cinnamon sticks and uh, the hot tamales and all these things when we were first uh, started dating and, and getting uh, getting uh, all cinnamon-y cinnamon -y together. Uh, so, uh, I love cinnamon, so it worked out really well, and I love her, so it worked out really well. And so, cinnamon. Oh, yeah. I made you some apple cider with a cinnamon stick, and it's hot. Here you go. There you go. Thanks. Thanks, Denise. It's, you welcome. know after a cold day out on the slopes, there, there's nothing yeah. I like to warm up my tummy. Yeah, I think I hope cider. it warms. <laughs> Smitty, I want it to warm up all your parts. Well, it's certainly warming up my throat, and my my stomach. It's 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 working its its way all over my my, my body. So, can I, I'm gonna tell I'm gonna tell you a secret too. Okay, I like secrets, and you know me, I I can keep my mouth shut and not tell people. So I I want to hear this secret. <laughs> <laughs> 
I'm counting on that, Smitty, because I don't want us to get in trouble here. I snuck in a bottle of rum into the campsite, and I put some in your in your hot cider with cinnamon. Yeah, that, that, <laughs> that, that's what I that's what I thought I tasted. You uh... don't 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 tell anybody, cause no, I, I, I don't want to get us in any kind of trouble. No way, no how. No, can, 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 I, can, I, can I tell you a secret? Oh, I love, oh goodness, yes. I won't tell anybody's secret because you can tell me anything and I won't, I'm so good at keeping secrets. I'm just, uh, okay, Smitty, tell me. For, okay, for, um, first I got to take myself another swig okay. of this. Yeah, me too. Yeah. I, I knew there was something good about that one. My, my, my mama said I should watch out for you because you was bad news. I, oh, I'm not. It, and me? I, I agree, I agree with her, but that, that's kind of what I, that's kind of what I like about you. <laughs> this is delicious. I had no idea I had that, that, that much of that. My reputation had been getting out there. I thought people were keeping a secret that I can be kind of fun. No, it's everybody knows, Lois. You're in trouble. Can I? Can you fill me up? Everybody knows you're a bag of trouble with a Ziploc top. I... And it... I started taking yoga for sex health. Yoga? Yeah. yeah. The oysters. Yeah. And then... I, it's just amazing how... How how much energy one man can can have. I just thought that was natural in you, Charlie. I didn't realize that you like really worked at it. I actually cried once. <sighs> I, I hate to admit it, but I cried. It's okay. You can cry during yoga. I mean that's No, during sex. Well, that's just weird then. I know. It's like not manly. I mean, yeah. I mean, during yoga, it makes sense. You're stretching and, and doing all sorts of things you probably shouldn't do in a natural life. But, but sex is like, it's the happy stuff. Do you know what it's like when a woman asks you, are you crying? <laughs> and you had to admit it? I did. Although she said she loved me deeper. She loved you deeper or she loved you comma deeper? Well. Okay, I admit it Gladys, I admit it. I am allergic to cinnamon. Well, you've come to the right place. I'm Dr. Allergina, and I may not be able to cure that particular allergy, but I can cure many other things. So your nickname's Gladys because they told me I was going to see Gladys. And yeah. if I just admitted it to some doctor, I don't know what I'm going to do. Well, yes, I am Gladys. I am Gladys. And Dr. Allerginia, Gladys Allerginia. Gladys Allerginia, oh my God. Okay, all right, well, I really need help, doctor. I really, really, really need help. Oh, you're so lucky because I am the best allergy in a planet properly as a doctor. And I also know how strange allergies can be. And I can see by your face, you're very upset right now. Well, there's some funny looking little brown twirly sticks there on your desk. What are those, Dr. Allerginia? Oh, these, they're merely little sticks. Oh, 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 yeah. achoo, achoo. Because, because I believe in exposure therapy. Exposure therapy. Expose yourself to the thing you oh, achoo, achoo. Doctor, doctor, doctor. I thought you were going to help me. I, 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 I thought you were you. going to help me. I am helping you. I am the best. And believe me, this technique works. Now bring your nose up to the stick. Come on. Oh, 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 oh my okay. God. I just like, I just, you got cinnamon buns around in your office just laying around. Well, yes, because it's an erotic scent. And that's probably why you're not having much sex, right? 
I'm not having, yeah, that's probably it. I'm so sorry for you. You've been so lonely, haven't you? Yeah, I've been really oh. lonely, Dr. Allergen. Yeah, I've been really lonely. Oh, well, I'm so glad you're here because I have an allergy group therapy, Allergenia, and people will come. It'll be Thursday night at six o'clock. So just come back then. But in the meantime, know that you're a beautiful powerful person with just a mild defect but you're very lovely otherwise what a nice nose you have oh, no what a nice even, nose you have. it's like it's, it's it's like full of allergies doc i i i, I yeah, oh, okay i'm gonna i'm gonna go and i'll see you on thursday listen mr mr Mor mr morrison i i'm a little bit um uncomfortable because it's my first day here at work but I, I, I've noticed that all the other em employees seem to have computers at their, their desk. And, and, and I came in and I, I, I don't have a, a computer at, at my desk. And I'm just worried that you did that on purpose. Johnson, we hired you. We told you that you needed to be industrious, entrepreneurial. You need to make things happen. Strong self-starter. Not this, where's my computer? I need to work. You gotta figure it out, Johnson, if you're gonna make it in this business. Times are wasting. So I guess what you're saying is, in fact, you did intentionally not give me a computer. I just, I like knowing the facts, so. Thank, thank you, you so much. I just put in my new computer. I just set up my new computer. It's, it's fabulous. You're welcome, Anderson. No problem, it's all good. This is a Mac you got for me. This is like amazing. It's the top of the line. You deserve it, Melanie. You're such a I'm great I'm so worker. glad to have a Dell computer today. Thank you so much. I'm the Dallas, absolutely. You guys are the best. My the MacBook Pro. My MacBook Pro. Oh my God, I love it. Thank you. I mean, and I know I've been doing a really I thought I goofed up last week, but apparently no. you didn't catch me. Oh Thank no, me. you're fine. You're fine. And the pencil, I've been writing you poems with the pencil on my touch screen, the new prototype touch screen that no right? other Mac has. Oh, really touched my heart. I Can't you be more like these people, Johnson? What's your problem? Fine, Mr. Morrison. I'm going to go over, push you aside, take your <laughs> computer. Now Mr. that's Morrison? what I'm talking about. All right. Welcome to flight 955. Mr. Brown, here is your complimentary drink. I, I take a complimentary drink and two Xanax. Oh, yes. Here, let me get them out of my pocket. Oh, you even, oh, I'll take two more, sure. I sure, okay. supply them even. Now, I've got some wonderful news for you, although you seem very anxious and a little bit worried, but wonderful news is that you are our 998,000 passenger on our wonderful airlines, and you have won a lifetime supply of Cinnabons. I, I, I'm actually going to a Cinnabon conference. Yes. I know. <laughs> and it's fantastic. Now, let's let's explore your worries because I used to be a therapist, but now I got a, a steady job with the airlines. So what are you so worried about? Well, planes crash. Ladies and gentlemen, this is your captain speaking. Oh Sorry, there's going to be a slight delay. Mechanics are working on an engine problem, but they should be getting along in just a couple of minutes. Our captain is wonderful. He's he's flown through geese flocks and survived. Oh. He's done all kinds of special landings. It's, it's It may be fine. Oh, my God. It may be. Your oxygen mask will come out, but so drink your drink up fast so you can... I drank uh, here, that i give one. you another one. Here, here's another drink. You're, you're... Ladies and gentlemen, we're sorry to inform you. There's some slight delay happening with the oxygen system on the plane, but we'll get some people to look at it in just a couple of minutes. In the meanwhile, sit back and your stewardess will help you with some extra cinnamon buns. That's right. 
fresh from the galley. No, Here I'm you go, sir. horny and sleepy at the same time. Wow. Well, maybe you could just rest your eyes a little bit and I can give you mouth to mouth. I, I, Brianna and, and Janice, they're not going to let us, they're not going to let us in. I don't think they want us in there in the group. Don't. They, 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 they don't want us in the group. They, they, they told me that we are not the special Easter bunnies. Yeah, I don't no, know. I'm, you, you sent me over. I said, hey, I'm Janice. I'm over here with Brianna and Lorraine. Right. Can we be part of the group? And they said no. They said no, Lorraine. They said no, Brianna. I said, you know, we're very special Easter bunnies. We're Santa bunnies. And it didn't matter. They don't seem to. We're not. We're, I think that we. I don't. Wait. You're gonna be okay. You're gonna be okay. It's all right. Just, just take a deep breath and say, "I am, I am lovable and capable and cute and cute. You're yeah. lovable and capable and we're cute. We're as good as we're as good as those other clicky bunnies. We're, we're better. Yeah, the rain. The rain. You're as cute as any bunny I have ever seen. And Brianna, you're as loyal as they come. And you're you're the best pepper ever. You could be a cheerleader if you wanted to. In fact, you ought to be a cheerleader bunny. <laughs> no, go, 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 go. That's so good. I'm so I I'm I'm so I'm so revved up. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I. Can, can I be honest with you guys? Please, please. Yes. This isn't helping. I want to be ah! part of the cool girl. No, this is not helping. It's not helping. No. <laughs> it looked like we had the right spice. I love spending time just listening to people complain and cry about their life and blah, 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 blah. Oh, this brings my heart joy. I know. I just got divorced and I'm, I'm, I'm pretty much on the street and nobody really loves me. Isn't that amazing? I mean, think of the life experiencing that you are going through right now. I failed every test that I have. Hey, ever... yo, 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 give me your wallet. Give me your wallet right now. God, I, I, Come really on. right here in front of this person. Right now, right now. God. Thank you. Did you feel that? That that sense of vulnerability? Is this supposed to be a learning experience? Come now. Think about it. It's an experience. Every experience you can learn something from. I did a lot of cinnamon when I was young. Maybe that screwed me up. Oh. Frank, Frank, I gotta tell you, I've been looking for you. I've been chasing you down. You know. I are fired. I'm sorry you don't have a job. And, you know, the doc called and said, you got like, you know, three days to live. Just and saying. He actually came to find me to tell me that I was fired. You couldn't even wait. You didn't no. even want me in the building anymore. No, don't, don't even come in there. You're, you're done, dude. You're out. Bye. And I'm dying. <laughs> this is so good. Doesn't it feel good to know that your, your time is limited? And it just brings so much more excitement to life. Three days. I'm gonna go get me a woman. Oh. Cut to I'm gonna the go woman. have some oysters. Cut to the woman. That was some damn strong cinnamon, I gotta tell you. <laughs> oh my god. Knock March. my socks off. Right? If I could ever. I didn't know that life could be so good. You know, it's my last 10 minutes, and you last gave burn. me a going away that I'll never... Can I have a drag of that cigarette? Sure. I, go for it. Go for it. Oh, 
Yeah, thank you. You know, I these uh these post cinnamon these post cinnamon. Can I just lay my head in your rags? Yeah, breasts. come on over. Come on over, yeah. As just, I, just, I I love feeling clothes after the cinnamon strikes, you know? I just love it so much. It's like good. Six PM? Seven PM. Six PM? Seven PM. Six PM? Seven PM. <laughs> Look at this. I'm I'm time traveling, Eleanor. Six PM? Seven PM. Six PM? Seven PM. PM. Let's go back to six PM. Six PM. Now let's go into the future. Seven PM. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. It's so much clearer here. You're yeah. a terrific time traveler. I love time traveling with you. Let's go back in time and tell them everything that's gonna happen at seven o'clock. Like right over there. Look, I can see that the the tree right now has green leaves. So let's go back an hour and tell them that. Yes. Seven PM. Oh, six PM. Ooh. Six PM. Oh, let's go. Do you, do you see that bird? Do you see that tree there? Yes. Hey, yes. everybody, the tree in an hour is going to be flapping. We know that for a fact. It's going to look exactly like it looks now. Okay, let's, let's go. Let's go to tomorrow. <laughs> That's a big jump, but I think we can wow. do it. Wow. 10 a.m. <laughs> The sun. Let your petals open to the sun. Now, now, the petals open to the sun. And then some SOB will pick us and we'll die. I, I got fertilized first. <laughs> Me too. You could too. Yeah, I was second. Oh. I, I was second. last. I wanted to make it go I'm as gonna... long as possible. Bye, I'm... my friends. I got all the desiccated oh, memory. Sweetie. Before I go, does anybody have any cinnamon? <laughs> It'll I be a quick stick one. right here. That's Thank that. you. I, oh, oh no! I hear I'm a lot more. I'm a. I'm a. I'm a. Ah, uh, one last. No. I see a tennis shoe coming at me. Oh no! Oh. Here, the lawnmower's getting closer. Mmm, <laughs> that was good. Oh, no, won't me. I want to live with a cinnamon stick all day long with my cinnamon stick. Who else wants to have a cinnamon stick? They are so good for you. I want to, I want to live with a cinnamon, cinnamon stick, stick too. I also I want to live a with a stick. Stick, a cinnamon stick to about three. One for you and one for me. I want to live with a cinnamon girl. A cinnamon girl. A cinnamon, cinnamon girl. I love when you lick me. It feels so good. I tingle your tongue and make it wanna run. I love to be with my cinnamon friends. Cinnamon friends, you make me aroused. Cinnamon friends, I love you too. Cinnamon friends will always be true. <laughs> Happy Cinnamon Day, everybody. Happy. Lick me. Lick me. Happy cinnamon.
day. Happy Cinnamon Day. Day. It's a good day in Cinnamon Land. Whether you're part of the gang or not, mm -hmm. it's a good day. It's a good day. Uh, yeah, so 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 I so I so I come every single year, and so I'll show you around the Cinnabon convention because that's what I like to do. Because I'm a regular, and newbies like you, a newbie like you, I want to make both of you. I want you to have a good time here at the Cinnabon convention. God, I can't wait for Cinnabon shuffleboard. Yeah. So the first rule okay. of the Cinnabon convention is to live in the here and now. So yeah, shuffleboard's going to be fantastic, but we're going to enjoy it at 4.30 p.m. when it's shuffleboard time. Now we get to eat the future flavors of Cinnabon. So take your sampler plate. Oh, yes. Yes, 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 yes. Come on, Daniel. Listen. Come on, 100. Come on, you I, can do I'm it. I'm beat that. Okay. You go, Carl. You go, Carl. Carl. <clears throat> 32. Oh, that was, that had a little bit of oak with just a touch of mint. I like it. Good. You know what the best part is? They have these surveys. Normally surveys aren't fun, but at the Cinnabon convention, we get to give our opinion of the Cinnabon flavors of the future. Can I have a survey? Can I have a survey? Oh, yeah. Here you go. Here you go, everybody. Oh, hey, you miss over there. Come on, join us. Here you go. Fill oh out gosh. the survey. Oh my gosh, this is like great. Oh, I'm so happy to be filling out a survey. I love surveys. <laughs> Wait, what? Uh -oh. Wait, are you allergic? Oh, my buddy. Are you allergic? My buddy, Bobby, was You're there? Allergic to oh my God, there was, there was pomegranate in that one, wasn't there? Oh. Well, oh, 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 oh mark it down. No pomegranate oh, in the future. Mangoes in mine. Oh, oh, my oh no! Oh, mangoes oh, in the future. Garlic. <laughs> garlic. Oh no! No garlic in the future. Oh. Mustard in mine. Oh. No mustard in yours. Oh man! These surveys are really going to save a lot of lives. <laughs> and that's our show. We are class act. Vintage Improv Festival's Five Star House Long Four Team coming at you every second Sunday of the month. Thank you and enjoy Pi Day tomorrow. And that's Steve. I'm Steve. Marco. Kyle. Frank. Welcome, Frank. Yeah, Frank. 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 <laughs> and that's Shirley. <laughs> Yeah, and this is Shirley. Uh, Shirley. Sticky, thank you for joining us. Stay tuned. We're going to have a mid, uh, early bird special in just a minute. Thank you so much. Bye. Bye-bye.